do a basic invert. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to do just a basic bicep grip inverted straddle. In another video, um, I am talking about how to take this inversion and make it spin, which makes it a lot more fun, but you're gonna wanna try to master the basic inversion first. Um, prior to learning any inversion, as I mentioned in my other video, you wanna make sure you're properly warmed up and that you're working on your flexibility and again, you can refer to Laura Michael's video when she talks about um, how to increase your straddle. It'll be more safe and your legs will look longer and leaner um, and your lines will look really pretty when you're inverting. You also wanna make sure that you have a spot probably when you're first learning how to invert and you have a crash mat to catch your fall in case your hands slip. But above all, you wanna make sure you have the strength and the coordination, the flexibility mastered from just basic regular uh, uh, pole dancing technique before you take it and you flip it upside down. So the proper grip for doing a bicep grip inverted straddle is called a bicep grip. You're going to reach your inside hand out to the side parallel to the ground. Okay, so about 90 degrees. You're going to bring that arm around in front of your shoulder and bend the elbow so the upper arm bone is now parallel to the ground. Um, a good way to make sure that your hand is in the proper position is if you release your pinky, you can poke yourself in the eye, <laughs> and so then you know you're in the proper position. Outside hand will come directly on top of that, pushing your top of your bicep into the pole and your oblique on the other side. So it's sort of sandwiched between your arm and the side of your body. You're going to drive the pole into the ground using the strength of your back. From there, you'll drive your knees into your chest. Your bicep grip will slide now into a little bit of an elbow brace. You'll extend your legs into your straddle, reaching your toes towards opposite ends of the room. And from there, you can either go into an upside down double knee brace and release that to the ground, tucking your chin into your chest. Um, or you can also just come out of it, step out of it on your inside leg and then your outside leg. 